Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are doing the third and the last part of the low poly dog modeling series. We will be doing unwrapping and texture painting our low poly model. I will drop links to the other two parts of the series in the description. Hope you like the video. And please like and subscribe my channel, and also ring the bell icon as well. So you can get notified of my upcoming videos. Let's start unwrapping. Turn off subdivision surface modifier, so we can see the low poly geometry. I will not be showing the basics of UV unwrapping, but I will go slow, so you all can watch and follow. We have used the mirror modifier, so we have to unwrap only one side of the model. Select all the edges of the neck. Right click. Click on mark seam. Now select the ear outer edge. Again right click, then mark seam. Same process is used for marking the rest of the seams. But if you accidentally select an edge and mark a seam, select that edge. Right click and clear seam. Go to the UV editing tab. In edit mode, press A to select all the faces. Press U, select unwrap. Press N on your keypad, click on view, click on overlay, check stretching. Now you can see your UV stretch zones. Our UV map is fine and ok to use. You can see if your UV map is stretched or not by their color. Blue is fine. Sky blue is ok, but if is green or red, try unwrapping again till the stretching is clear. Go to shading tab. Click on new. Press shift A, texture then image texture. Drag the color input into base color. Click on new. Rename the name of the image, it's totally optional. Choose your desired color. Then press OK. Go to texture paint tab. Drag open another window and choose shader editor
I forgot to change the specular level when I was in shading tab. Lower the specular level a lot. Increase the roughness a bit. This is looking good now. Open an image editor in the outline window. Select your desire color, in my case I choose the color from the image. Lower the size and strength of the brush. It's time to paint. Many of you guys will think, it is time for Photoshop or GIMP. But I will tell you to start painting directly on your model. It is totally on your skill and imagination now. It's looking much better now. Our low poly Doberman model is done and is looking beautiful. Turn on subdivision surface. Save your model. Well if you like the video, please like and subscribe. See you in my next video. Happy blending. Take care.